my, my SQL showing grants. So there will be times wherein we would like to know what are the grants given to the user or the users. Or maybe as a user, you want to know what are the grants and the privileges given to you as a user. So to do this, uh, we can, this will be demonstrated by this video. So first, a short introduction, MySQL Show Grants. The MySQL Show Grants statement returns all privileges and roles granted to an account user or role. So the syntax is show grants for user or role, then using role. Code language, SQL, structured query language, SQL in this syntax. So in this syntax, first specify the name of the user account or role that you want to display the privileges that are previously granted to the user account or role after the four keyword. So show grants and then for the user or the role. If you skip the four close, the show grants returns the privileges of the current user. Second, use the using close to examine the privileges associated with the roles for the user. The roles that you specify in the using clause must be used in granted to the user. Uh, but for this video, we'll be skipping the using clause just because the version of the MySQL I'm using is quite not the latest one, and roles are not yet supported by this version of MySQL. Show grants. To display the privileges granted to the current user. We type show grants. Again, if you don't specify, that's the same as show grants for current user. Or show grants for current users. These are actually similar. Or we just type show grants for and then the account name. So as an example, display the privilege granted for you, so we just type show grants for and then the account name. So show grants for, for example, in this uh, slide, it is jump at local codes. So that's all. And let's try to have a short demo. So first, I must be sure that my, my SQL is uh, running. So uh, as you can see, it's running so let me now open my mysql command line client so i'm going to open a command prompt and then so i'm going to the path to where my mysql is located mysql should be in so that's a path so to open using the root user MySQL dash u root dash p then enter the password. <clears throat> so I have now logged in as a root user. So I would like to display or I would like to show the privileges of the root user. So I just type show and then grants. So again, if you don't specify the name of the user, then that means you are showing the privileges of the current user. So, yeah, grant all privileges on asterisk to asterisk to root at local host will grant options will grant proxy on so at the root local host will grant options. So that means that all privileges are given to root on all objects of MySQL. So all database, all tables of so that's a super user. Okay. How about the privileges of other users? So let's first display uh, the username. User from mysql.user. So this will display the user names or the account names. So I have here several accounts. So let's say I would like to show the privileges of Daisy. Show grants for Daisy at localhost because that's the host name I use for that account. So again, if the privilege is only this, then that means he can only log in. There are no other 
privileges. How about for Jack? Let's try to display the privileges of Jack. So Jack can log in and also is granted the select privilege to the app table of the job. Okay. Now let's try to grant another privilege to job. Let's say grant insert on job db that m to job at local host. So what did we do? We just granted another privilege to job. And that is what privilege to insert on the job db that so let's try show grants for job at localhost. So you notice now that job here is granted the select and the insert privileges on the M table of the job database. So that's all for this demo. And see you again on my next video tutorial. Thank you.